Viewing from anterior, bursal tissue is being excised. The head is at the top and the foot at the bottom. The undersurface of the iliotibial band is being debrided of fibrous tissue. The vastus lateralis is seen on the right. Orientation to these structures is important while completing the iliotibial band tendoplasty. A vertical incision is begun, typically 6 to 10 centimeters in length, and this is paired with two transverse incisions in the iliotibial band. The length of the incisions is adjusted to the size of the patient and titrated to the amount of tension on the tendon. This simply relaxes the tendon and eliminates the snapping and should not alter its function. This is a simple procedure but excessive release must be avoided because compromise of the abductor mechanism can lead to a virtually unsalvageable problem. After completing the tendoplasty, relationship to the vastus lateralis is again visualized. 